Good morning, everyone. It is Trish, and I am out here today, and I want to talk to you about putting. We have visited putting before, but it's always good to revisit. Why is it always good to revisit? Because putting makes up 50% of our game, at least. So when we play, sorry, it's a little sunny out here. When we play, we have to concentrate on putting. So I have a question for you. Do you want to roll the ball to the hole or at the hole? Okay, I've asked this question before in previous videos, but I'm going to ask it again. Do you want to roll the ball to the hole or at the hole? So I have a ball right here, and if I go to the hole, my distance will be correct. If I go at the hole, the direction might be good, but the distance will be incorrect. So focus on to the hole versus at the hole. And you might have seen the tour when you watch golf on TV, you might see people pretending to toss the ball to the hole. They're giving themselves an idea of how hard or how much energy to put into the shot. So when I'm out here and I'm practicing my putting, I like to think about just rolling the ball to the hole. All right, let's give it a try. All right, so you see my distance was absolutely correct. My direction was a little bit off, but that's a makeable tap-in putt that I don't have to worry about the next time. If I were to go at the hole instead of to the hole, I might stub it or I might hit it way past the hole and then I have like a 15-foot putt coming back. So remember, to the hole versus at the hole. Does that kind of make sense? Anyway, come see me. I'm out here. I am at Madison Green and Royal Palm Beach, Southwinds Golf Course in Boca Raton. And anytime you want, hit like and subscribe to this channel for more great tips and tricks to help you improve your game. And until next week, keep it in the short grass.